frozen in the icy grip of Navar's dark magic. Now only one thing can break this spell. The mystical waters that are to be found far to the east, behind the walls of the secret temple. Warriors, we are here on a vital quest. Together, we must discover the temple of the three-headed serpent. For deep beneath its walls, there lies a well, the waters of which will bring back life to any land. I need these waters to reclaim my homeland from the dark spell Navar has cast upon it. Remember, the temple will reveal itself only to the most deserving of warriors. No mortal may enter its secret portals till 14 tasks have been completed. Know now that I have divided your number into four. These I have named wolves, panthers, tigers, and eagles. But as yet, you have no leaders. And a warrior without a leader is like a ship without a rudder, drifting aimlessly upon the tide. So I have devised the means to choose amongst you quickly and fairly. So come. I am part of the panther team, and I think I have the same qualities as a panther as I'm able to think on my feet and then go really fast. I think I'd make a good warrior because I have team spirit, I'm adventurous, and I'm driven to win. It's really important to get along with all your fellow warriors so then you don't argue when, in, when you're doing team games. I'm always up for a challenge and it sounds a bit weird, but I like being under pressure. Here now lies your challenge. Ropes that lead everywhere and nowhere. But do not be angered by this difficulty. Remember, good leaders keep their heads, however naughty the problem appears to be. If the bracelet is released from your wrist at any time, you will be excluded from the challenge. The first two to unravel these coils and transport the rings to the far end will then challenge each other in a further contest. Then, finally, the true leader will be chosen. Each warrior must concentrate on their own path, no matter how entwined they become. To think clearly in the heat of battle, to take the unexpected in your stride, is the mark of a true leader. You shall soon see which of these warriors has such qualities. You have trained them well, Raven. Are they prepared for the journey? The leaders are being chosen. They will be ready. Good. The task will begin with the morning sun. I trust you will judge them fairly, Sajarani. They will be judged as all are judged, Raven. No less, no more. Aksu looks to have made good progress, but appearances can be deceptive.
The warriors do well, Raven. I wish them good fortune on their journey. They will strive to succeed. I am certain of it. Then let us hope they are not hindered in their tasks. Sacharani? I have learned to trust this land, Raven. I can read it like a book. A flash of sunlight on water, the wind blowing warm and gentle across the great palm leaves, even the movement of insects in the dust. They tell me when all is well in the world and when it is not. And what do these things tell you now? That we must be vigilant. There is a darkness growing in the great stones that surround us. Long shadows are gathering on the burning sand. Shadows that seek to destroy you, Raven. And the young warriors too. Someone, something has followed you here. Who is it? Who comes here now? Nevar. And he has but one goal. To reign supreme over my homeland. To destroy me utterly. To bring all good things to heal and to make them subjects of his dark rule. Eagles are very strong and they're very clever and I think that also explains me. I think my strongest quality is that I'm always happy. I think I'm really supportive and I can analyse things well and I can handle the heat. I'm very determined and I'm a good team player. That's what I think will make me a great warrior. Eagles, these slender threads alone stand in the way of your ambitions to be leader. Remember, the first two warriors to reach the far side will contest further for the honor of the leadership. But take great care. These cords will quickly bind those who are too hasty. These warriors are lucky. There are no sleeping demons to wake at the sound of the bells. They may travel through the threads, unheeding of the noise. I think that I would make a good wolf because I'm fast, I'm very quiet, and I can work well in a team. I think the qualities that will make me a great warrior is I encourage everyone and I'm physically strong. I'm confident that I can win this and I'm really cunning. I like running about and jumping and I'm quite clever so I think these skills will make me a great warrior. Wolves, these pieces of wood are your only means of passage across the columns. You must use them quickly but not so quickly that you fall. The first two warriors to cross this causeway will then compete together for the honor of the leadership. Tibor has failed this task, as his foot left the raised pathway and touched the floor. He is lucky that he does not pay a harsher penalty. Young Desot progresses well, with Tibor excluded. Who will take their place in the next contest? Though he finished the course, Tibor has no place in the next test. I think I made a great warrior because I'm adventurous, I love throwing out challenges and I'm up for a good laugh. I like challenges which challenge me mentally and physically and I enjoy having lots of fun. I'm very brave, I'm very adventurous and I also like trying out new things. I'm sporty and I like doing extreme sports like climbing and abseiling and I enjoy a challenge.
Tigers, the way forward here is not clear. So let your mind and not your feet be your guide. Only one symbol will lead you to your destination. So think, then walk. For if you should take the wrong pathway, you must return to the starting point and try again. And remember, this is a race. Only the first two warriors to reach the far side will compete together for the leadership. Adav, Marsa, General and Sohar have all chosen the correct symbols and must continue on that path. Marsa and General will compete for the leadership of the Tigers. Where is he? Far to the north. I may have to do battle soon, Sacharani. He will be as determined to stop this quest as I am to complete it. We shall see who is strongest here. Keep watch over this creature, Raven. For the sake of the quest, if you want the warriors to succeed, this monster must be kept at bay. I know it. Do not worry, Sacharani. The tasks will continue. I will make sure of it. I am glad of it, but beware. I have seen the forces ranged against you, Raven. You must be careful. I shall be. I must be. Aksu, Yonra. I fear the confusion with the ropes may have entangled your minds also. This leaves Sonro and Arton to stand together to decide who is the true leader of the Panthers. Let your prowess with the catapult decide between you. This is the most simple of tests between Sonro and Arton. Whoever fells the most pots before the second drum sounds will lead the Panthers in this difficult and dangerous quest. Elan, Yida, you are indeed the most agile of your group. But now, let us test the agility of your minds. Yonder lie two columns shattered on the ground. Each of you must reassemble the stones to make them whole again. Whoever has the quickest eye for this task will win the leadership. This task will test not only the warriors' minds, but also their skill as they piece together this block of stone. Get the curve on! Come on, Titan! This challenge required swiftness of foot and a quick mind. Tibor was one of the swiftest, but he stepped down from the causeway. And so Desot and Lymel will now compete for the leadership. Take up these bows and let the arrows decide which of you it is to be. Desot and Lymel must strive to pierce the demon face that greets them. First to do so shall be the leader of the wolves. That's okay, come on, keep going! Keep going! You can come do it! On. Nice try, come on! Keep going! Nice try, keep going! You can do it! 
Besot and Lyman are finding accuracy difficult. Who will lead the wolves? Marsa, General, you have proved the quickness of your minds, but the strength in your arms may let you down. We shall see. Strength and balance are needed in equal measure if the warriors are to stay on the pedestals for long. Fight for the leader, General. That's it, really put your energy into it. This age-old test of the warrior's art depends on fine balance and strategic use of the padded mace. It's really hard. A feisty contest between two great warriors. Who will prevail? Come on. Woo With one hit each, the next to score, Arton or Sonru, will be the leader of the Panthers. Sonru. You are to be applauded. The Panthers have found their new leader. I was really overjoyed when I knocked over those two pots because I really wanted to be the leader of the Panthers. The Warriors make slow progress here. Who will prove a worthy leader for the Eagles? Taylan or Yeda? Congratulations, Yeda. The task is complete. From now on, you will be known as the leader of the Eagles. I got a bit stuck on the top two, so I put them down on the floor and tried to fit them together, and it worked. So now I'm the leader of the Eagles. Keep shooting! Desot and Lymel of the Wolves seem beguiled by the demons' faces, for neither has yet struck home with an arrow. Keep going! Warriors, a good contest. I commend your skills, Desot. Now, you must take your place as the head of the wolves. Archery was actually pretty tough, but the trick was to aim just below the target and then you'd actually hit the target. There is only one more contest to be decided by the Tigers. Then all four leaders will be in place. In the end, there is only one true test of a leader, to let them lead and see if any will follow. They both have little energy there. General and Marsa are proving fine warriors, as nothing separates them. That's a general. Come on, Marsa. Lo 
Lock it. Yeah, j just keep hitting him. Oh. Yeah. This battle is fast. Come on, go for it. Warriors, a truly epic battle. Marsa, I congratulate you. You are the final leader to be chosen. General was really good, but I just kept on going and eventually he fell off and I won. Warriors, I trust these tests have proved fruitful and that each of the four teams has its rightful commander. Or know this, from this moment on, the quest will be long and arduous. We are far from home, and the ways of this place are strange to us all. But there is one who knows this land well, for she is fashioned from the very earth that lies beneath our feet. She alone will introduce you to the 14 tasks, tasks you must undertake before you are deemed worthy to descend into the dark chambers of the secret temple. Warriors, such a rani. Welcome to my country, brave warriors. Which of you are the leaders? Desot of the wolves. The wolf is not a solitary creature. He knows that many can achieve what one cannot. So be like the wolves, Desot. Work with your companions for the common good and you will succeed. I promise. This is the leader of the Panthers, Sonro. The Panthers' agility and swiftness is unparalleled in this land. May you and your warriors progress as surely to the secret temple and success. Marsa is the leader of the Tigers, Sacharani. That most feared of animals stalks his prey relentlessly. Imitate him, Marsa. Never give up your quarry. And when it seems all is lost, have the courage to go on till the day is won. And finally, Yeda. Of the eagles. That noble creature spies more than most as it soars in the sky. And they act quickly on what they see. Be as keen-eyed as that great creature and you will succeed. I am sure of it. Now, may good fortune follow all of you on this most important mission. And remember, I will only allow those of exceptional courage, strength and wisdom to enter the secret temple. Desot, Sonro, Marsa and Yeda, guide your teams well, for tomorrow the quest begins. I think I'll make a great leader because I'm going to give everyone a fair chance for their ideas and hopefully I'll be the best that I can be. I think I'll make a great leader of the Panthers because I always think things through before I do them. I will make a great leader for the Eagles because I will listen to everyone and make sure they're happy. I feel absolutely ecstatic that I'm leader. I think that I can get the best out of my team and I'm the best man for the job. To each of you now, I give six of these precious jewels. See how they glow. As you complete the 14 tasks, you will collect many more. When the tasks are complete, whoever has the greatest number will go forward with this quest. But for the rest, there will be no such honor. Remember this also. If any of your comrades should perish in the struggles ahead, eight of these precious jewels will bring them back to life. But I will only allow this privilege once for each warrior. And take heed, the loss of a comrade will be hard to bear, but the loss of too many of these gems may prove fatal to the success of your team. So, Sandra, Marsa, Yeda, and Dessa, be wise when you make your choices. Always remind yourself why you are here, to complete the quest. 
to find the magical waters guarded by the three-headed serpent and to save Raven's homeland. Now the night creeps on apace, and the warriors are resting. I know Navar has pursued me here, so I must do all I can to stop his dark progress through this land. Or for certain, this errand will come to nothing before it is even begun. Next time on Raven, the secret temple. Will the tigers be courageous enough for the ledge? Can the eagles solve riddle trap? Do the wolves have the strength to ride the chariots? Could waters of time dampen the panther's spirits? Navar is lurking. I must guard my young charges well.